Hello guys, we just saw Stone Era Hearts and we are not going to attempt the title of the song because it's impossible for everyone except them. But what we saw so far suggests that there's an idea of a staging. And I'm going to just say it this way because uh, it's still... The guys are on the stage, they have the same choreo move that on Estilal, but it seems tidier than what we saw on their national final. The guy that starts the song uh, on the recorded version, he is off the stage while he sings the first verses. There's a camera in front of him that moves um, backwards, so we can assume that, that that singer is going to be running around the stage or at least a certain part of it, and then he's gonna go up to join his fellow band members. There is some color in the background. They have these squares that change of color. There's a main color block. Uh, there's a main color of the squares that is orangey. But when the tel tel harpers uh, come in, the stage divides in in pink and in green. And it seems like uh, they go side to side, uh, synchronized to the performers' movements. It looks like they are trying some sort of battle between those two guys uh, coming at each other, which it probably refers to the conversation about drugs that are happening uh, on the stage. Meanwhile, like, you know, because the song is about, we don't know anything about the drugs, so I can just assume they're being interrogated. But anyway, it looks tidier than what we saw on the national final, which I'm very happy about. Uh, the guys are in black, they're wearing their, their suits, very fancy suits, they all have their sunglasses on, so for me personally it's like an elevation of the song itself. They sounded great in the little clip we were treated with by Eurovision, but I think visually it's more relaxing to watch, it's not as frantic as in, in Estilal, so I am happy to see that. But what do you guys think about the 15 second clip we saw on TikTok? Let us know in the comments down below and we look forward to more rehearsal reviews here from Malmo.